Hey guys, we're back to another video. In this video, I will be doing a review of the Karen Sultan RS. This is just the regular Sultan, not the Benny's version. This is the one that can go to Benny's though. Um, this is part of my sports car review series that I'm doing. And I'll have a link to that playlist in the, in, the, in the description. And then this is also a part of my just car review series in general, believe it or not. And I will have that in the description, in the description when this video is being uploaded sports cars the only ones in there it's because it's the only ones that I've made but uh, as the series goes along you'll have more and more classes of car in there so I'm not just only doing the sports cars or anything like that uh, eventually it will get more and more in there and it will be more diverse uh, if, anyway if you like what you see make sure you like the video uh, subscribe to the channel for more comment down below if you want uh, if you have a question or whatever, uh, if you have a question, I'll try to get back to you. Uh, if I can't answer your question, I'll just tell you that motherfucker, I can't answer it. But hopefully, I can. This is one of the slower sports cars in the game. It has a minute and a half, a little bit more than a minute and a half to get down the track. And that's fucking slow uh, for the sports cars, even because that's about five to three seconds shorter than what most are, and that's uh, more than that's more than 11 seconds short uh, longer than the Pariah is the Sultan is $12,000 but it's also easily found on the street uh, not that hard to find you don't have to even spend 12000 on it you can insure it and pay seven or 6000 in total instead right so it's not really a big deal uh, the Sultan very good drifter right that's what it's kind of known for the in my opinion the turning of it could be a little better the handling yeah, maybe you know the acceleration of it very fucking slow right like it's not it needs to you know I wish the acceleration was better the uh, car itself at top speed is slow right it's not the fastest car around it's a very good drifter though like that's one of the strongest things about it uh, it's just you know it's fun to drive around if you're not taking it serious about driving this then, and you're just fucking around in free mode or whatever, then you'll enjoy it. It's a fun car to fuck around with. Um, it's easy. It's just it's just a really nice car just to fuck around with. It's cheap as shit, right? You can find it on the street, too. So you don't even have to pay the 12000 for it. And that's on Southern San Andreas is where you can buy it. And uh, it can be upgraded to Benny's, right? So say this isn't doing it for you, you would just get the Benny's upgrade. Now, the bad thing about the Benny's upgrade, though, is that it makes it a supercar, and for the super class, the Sultan does not belong at all. Uh, I haven't tested it yet, but I know that it doesn't belong in the super class. It honestly is just it's stupid that they put it there, but they did. Um, so, if you're going to be trying to use this in races, do not upgrade it in Benny's. The Sultan, though, what's kind of cool about it is the... You can have a lot of them just because, well, you know, they're cheap. So you can have a lot of them do different things with them. And I kind of like this uh, look of it and just how fun it is to drive around sometimes. Like I said, the handling of it could be a little better sometimes, but, you know, it's not too, too bad. Anyways, if you guys enjoyed the video, leave a like on it. If you uh, want more content in the future, make sure you go ahead and subscribe to the channel. If you have any questions, make sure you comment down below. I'll try to get back to you and answer you. If I can't, then I'll tell you. The next part of the video is set for four times faster than what it was recorded. To fix that and to slow it down, hit the setting, go into the toolbar, go to settings, playback speed, and turn the um, playback speed to 0.25. This will change it for all videos that you watch on YouTube. But after you watch the video, just change it back to one time and you're back to where you need to be. That is just so that I can shorten the video as much as I can, and anything that is unnecessary I can leave out. Um, just because, you know, most people don't care about the customization, but the people that do, boom, you can watch it. If you don't want to watch it, that's fine. The video's over anyway. Like I said, hope you guys enjoyed the video. See you guys next one, hopefully. Stay safe. Peace out.